Okay, so here we are gaming once again on Linux Kubuntu. Since I upgraded my PC, we should be able to run some more graphically intensive games. So today we're going to be playing X-Plane 11. It actually runs natively on Linux, and you can get it through Steam, so it makes it nice and easy. Okay, so I figured to start off with, we will we'll take off from Tampa International in this Cessna Skyhawk. It's got floats on it, so we should be able to play around in the water a little bit. Okay, so we're in our plane here. Check and make sure everything looks good. See if we can get an outside camera view here. Yep, everything looks good. Gears are down. And we'll play with the controls a little bit here. Make sure they all work. And for some reason my guy is turning his head in relation to the ailerons. That's pretty goofy. <laughs> but uh, we'll go ahead and get it fired up here. And we'll take off. We'll probably head towards Clearwater and probably fly up and down the beach just to just to see what that looks like. So we got our flaps down here, we'll go ahead and take off. Okay, so we'll go ahead and get our gear put up here and flaps up the full. Okay, so we got a map pulled up here. So it looks like to get to clear water, we just have to make a 90 degree left hand turn. So we'll take a look at the temp airport just to get a glimpse of that. Yep, that looks pretty nice, and we'll make that left turn here a little bit. Yeah, just for fun here, we'll, this looks like it's Interstate 279, so we'll go ahead and fly pretty low just to buzz some of these cars.
And off to the left here, it looks like that's the St. Pete Airport, I'm guessing. Yep. Yeah, as you can see straight ahead there, that little strip of beach, that is Clearwater Beach. So once we get there, we'll fly up and down, and we'll try to land in the water, and then maybe park in one of the houses there. Before we get to the beach, we'll check out Clearwater Airport here. We'll buzz it just to see what kind of planes they got down there. Probably mostly just Cessna is usually what the game fills in as the default, but we'll check it out here. Okay, so here we are at Clearwater Beach. We'll get pretty close here. And the game makes it look pretty ugly. It looks way better than in real life. But, uh, yeah, we'll fly. Maybe just do one pass. And see if we can park at one of the one of the houses there in the bay. Looks like a good neighborhood right there, so we'll go ahead and cut the power and put our flaps down to full and see if we can land it right here. Do a pretty steep bank turn to make it down there.
All right, we flared and we're landed. So once we slow down a little bit here, we will we'll try to creep up on the land there, put our landing gear down, and that looks like a pretty good garage right there, so we'll drive up right to it and see if we can park it right there. Alright, so we're moving on the land, and they put a tree right in the middle of the road, so that's always great. <laughs> okay, so we'll try to park right here to the right, we'll go ahead and slowly creep it up here. Make some tiny adjustments, see if we can get it parked. Just a little bit further, and it's about good right there, maybe a tiny bit more. Yeah, that's probably pretty good. Okay, so we're parked. We'll switch back to the interior view here. We'll go ahead and turn everything off. Flip those switches and turn the engines off here. Yep, the blade propeller stopped. And I think you can even open up this door. Yep, looks like we're good. Okay, that should be about it. Thanks for watching.